Hey everyone, um, yet again I went to another garage sale um, over the weekend and I got some more stuff. Um, not as much as before, but still I'm happy with what I found. Um, I got this cat figurine, well like a cat statue. Um, I really liked this when I saw it and I had to grab it right away. And I had the cute like red bow around its neck. And then it has that felt on the bottom so it doesn't scratch the furniture. And the cat has blue eyes. So that's going to go in my cat collection I have. This is like one of the bigger um, cat figurines or um, figures that I have. And then I found this ghost candle holder. It was 50 cents. The cat was uh, had a sticker price on it for $3, but I managed to haggle. Haggled, haggled them down to one dollar and then this was fifty cents and I'm not sure where it's from this is exclusively from Midwest something they didn't have two, it would have been better if they had two to have like two matching candlesticks, they only had the one and there's a pumpkin over there in the back I think I've seen something similar like this in those um I forgot the name of the catalog but I think I've seen something similar like th like those in those um, catalogs that I get in the mail. And then I got this ring with these pink stones. My favorite jewelry to wear are rings because those are easy. You can just slip them on and off really easily, really easily. So I really like rings. And this one is with cherries and it's adjustable. And then I found this really pretty um, bracelet with this red dangly heart on there. And then I got this cool bracelet. Let me see if I know how to close it so I can show you guys. Um, well, I can't get it right now, but it looks like this. And then it has a heart over here at the end, and it's metal. And then it's supposed to close. And then you, like that. And then I got this bracelet, this one, one of the vintage ones, the old-fashioned ones. It's adjustable. It's like metal or something. And then I got this raccoon stuffed animal. I really like the color combinations on here, and I like raccoons. I like the blue with the pink and the black. Really cute. And then I got this Halloween decoration. The eyes and the mouth are supposed to like light up, but it, um, the batteries are dead, and it takes those stupid batteries that I hate, those round silver ones, like, like for watches and for other things. But I ordered a pack from Amazon a couple of days ago, and they shipped them out today, so I'm hoping that the batteries will match this decoration, and um, I hope that um, they work, because inside those old batteries, they were kind of leaking, so they had old like battery acid in there, so I'm hoping um, it's not too messed up, and those new batteries I ordered from Amazon will work. And I really like this a lot. I like anything with jack-o'-lanterns. I love the witch's hat and, and how he's wearing the, gl the glasses. There's nothing wrong with them aside his, about, of his batteries uh, that were dead. There's nothing, there's nothing wrong with them. He's in really great condition. Really nice. And then I got this picture that you hang on the wall of this half moon. I like anything with sun, moon, and stars, anything celestial. And it says it was originally from Kohl's for $18.99 on the back. Um, I, I think he had a price tag on there of $3 and I got it for a dollar. So I really like that. And then I forgot in my last video to show you that cat pillow. And I got this cat pillow. That lady had two of the same but I only wanted one. I thought that was really cute and it has like flowers and I, I like the roses on the bottom. That was a dollar.
And then I got this huge penguin stuffed animal. It had a price tag on it of three dollars, but he went down to a dollar for it. And she's in really good condition. I love purple and pink, and her eyes are like glittery and blue, and she has a blue glittery bow in her hair, and her feet are pink and they're glittery. And then last, I think I have one more thing. Yeah, oh no, two more. This witch, she had a price tag of $5 on her, but I managed to get them down to $2. And you press her wrist and her eyes light up. <laughs> so yeah, I really don't like witches that much. I'm picky in what kind of witches I like, but I couldn't pass her up, especially since at garage sales you can haggle with people. And I know that she costs a lot, something like this costs a lot, so um, I grabbed her as well. And then the last thing, I got another purse. This is just like a plain black purse because I needed a new like plain black purse for everyday wear. And this one's by Stone Mountain. And it has a zipper on the back. And then it has a zipper on the front too. And then the main zipper. And I think it's um, it still has a tissue inside. Yep, it's new. It still has a tissue inside. I didn't even look in it yet because everything was still in, in, in bags. I left everything in the bags until now, until I was ready to film. Oh my god, the inside is super pretty. Look at that. It's green. And it has some like that black design in there. I love that. I love that color. Oh my god. And then it has a another compartment inside for I guess you can put your makeup in there and then it has some compartments on this side too and like this is one of the prettiest um, purses that I bought that that, that, uh, that has such a nice inside of the purse I like that green a lot so like I said it was basically brand new the paper still was in there and it's again it's by Stone Mountain and then it says Stone Mountain on the zipper pool as well and then, like I said, it has another zipper in the back, too, another compartment in the back. I forgot how much this purse was. Um, I think it was one or two dollars, maybe two dollars. So that's all I have to show you for now. And these arm warmers, I just did like a try-on haul. And these are the ones I got from the garage sale last week with the skulls on here. So, yeah. We got those last week. So yeah, that's it for now. Thanks everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.